to be honest right now. I'm still thinking about that. Um, <laughs> but I guess I'll try to paint a picture for those who don't know John that well, or as well as I do. Um, for, for introductions, we walked in, and as Crichton introduced us, John had asked us to write that introduction for ourselves. Um, there's a lot of things that I wanted to say, and for those of you who are here to hear it, um, all those things are true, by the way. Uh, but there's a favorite memory that um, I wanted to share that I did in the introduction because already all the things that I had in there was long enough. And if I were to share that favorite memory, it would have been a lot longer. Anyways, um, my favorite memory of John for the past 10 plus years that I've known him was, and to be honest, was something that happened earlier today. Um, this morning in the temple, I was privileged, honored to see my friend get sealed to the love of his life for all time and eternity. And what made this moment so special to me was the fact that I got to see him the entire time. Because where I was seated, I saw Otto's back, but I saw John's face the entire time. Uh, during the vows, and when they, when they said their yeses, um, I saw John's face the entire time. And, you know, I've never seen that side of John um, the time that I've, you know, known him and times that we've been together. But all I saw was, was true love. And it really pierced my heart. And to be honest, I can count on maybe one hand the number of times that I've had that feeling. I felt that emotion. Um, so for those of you who don't know John that well, maybe off the side of the family, maybe you met him today or a couple of days ago. John, he's a number of things. He's, you know, he's, he's, going, he's super athletic. He's an intelligent guy. He's a funny guy once you get to know him. Um, but what impresses me the most about him is the big heart that he has. John, um, he has a lot of love to give, and I hope Atta knows that, she probably does. Um, so with that said, uh, for Atta's family and friends, know that Atta's in good hands, and that whatever happens to them, um, that John will love no matter what. And, <laughs> I just want to wish the couple um, just a happy life. John, remember the saying, happy wife, happy life. So <laughs> whatever I'll to ask you to do, even if you don't agree, just do it, bro. <laughs> and also know that um, because John has a big heart, that you can practically do anything, get away with it. So <laughs> and he'll forgive you. I'm just kidding. Um, but just remember to love each other. Um, Build on your strengths and your weaknesses. Um, I'm talking as if I know marriage. I, I'm, I'm like the only single guy in the bridal line, bridal party. Uh, but um, I do know true love when I see it, and I saw it earlier today. And I guess that's what I wanted to share with you all. Thank you. Best man speech of the year. All right, thank you to John Cummins, our best man.